is this the smoothest humanoid robot we've seen to date? According to its creators, it just might be. And after watching it in action, it's hard to argue. This is the Unitree G1, a next-generation humanoid robot that's been generating buzz since it was first announced back in May 2024. Now, with its latest upgrade, Unitree is showcasing some serious improvements in agility, responsiveness, and terrain handling that make the G1 stand out in a rapidly growing field of humanoid bots. Physically, the G1 is compact and lightweight. It stands 4 feet 3 inches tall and weighs just over 77 pounds. That's significantly smaller and lighter than one of its most recognizable competitors, Tesla's Optimus, which stands at 5 foot 8 and weighs around 170 pounds. And this difference in size isn't just cosmetic, it directly translates to improved mobility. Smaller frame, less weight, faster reaction time, and better balance on unpredictable surfaces. In the latest demo released by Unitree, the G1 can be seen briskly jogging over rough terrain, climbing steep inclines, and recovering from movements with surprising smoothness. These aren't pre-programmed stunts, it's dynamically responding to its environment in real time. That's largely thanks to its onboard 3D LiDAR and depth camera, which work together to give the G1 a continuous awareness of its surroundings. It's essentially building a 3D map as it moves, adjusting its posture and step with each new data point. Battery life? You're looking at about two hours of continuous use on a single charge. But Unitree has made sure that downtime doesn't hold things back. They've introduced a quick-release battery system, which makes hot-swapping batteries fast and simple. For developers running long tests or researchers conducting extended experiments, this is a game-changer. And yes, you can actually buy one. The Unitree G1 starts at $16,000. While that's far from consumer-level pricing, it's noticeably more affordable than the estimated $20,000 to $30,000 price tag associated with the Tesla Optimus. That cost difference alone makes the G1 a much more accessible platform for early-stage robotics development. But make no mistake, this robot isn't made for your living room. It's a platform built with developers, universities, and researchers research institutions in mind. It's open source, which means software teams can dig into its code base, modify behaviors, train new models, and experiment without being locked into a proprietary system. That kind of flexibility is exactly what developers and robotics researchers are looking for when testing new algorithms, control systems, or AI integrations. So, is the G1 the most agile humanoid robot available right now? It's certainly making a strong case. It may not not have the brand recognition of Tesla, but in terms of practical mobility, real-time responsiveness, and developer accessibility, it's a serious contender. What do you think? Is the G1 enough to lead the next wave of humanoid robotics? Or are you waiting to see what other players bring to the table? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Be sure to like the video if you found it interesting, subscribe for more tech deep dives, and hit that bell so you don't miss what's next. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.